Hello, anyone and everyone, I am Echo, and today we're exploring Final Fantasy VII. Yay, we're back here again, and I don't remember where the hell we are, because it's been a while since I last recorded anything. I think we came from the down section, right? So we should head up to go into the slummy town place where Aerith lives. Aerith, whatever her name is, I don't remember. Um, I know that... The whole debate of... Why are there enemies here? What? Are these, like, muggers? I guess so. Okay, cool. Um, but yeah, the whole uh, the debate about Eris or Aerith's name... It's Eris in this, okay. Um, is that, like, one of them is the English translation, and they got it wrong because they changed it? And I guess, since it's Eris and this, and this is the, you know, English version of the game, I'm guessing Eris is the incorrect one, and Aerith is correct and stuff, but, like, I don't know, it's such a small difference, it, it, I feel like it doesn't matter. Like, if her original name was Aerith, and they translated the game, and they were like, let's name her Tony, or something stupid like that, I could see the, I could see the annoyance, but they're practically the same name. And all it is is probably caused by, like, a difference of pronunciation um, between Japanese and English. You know, Aerith sort of sounds like Eris if you just say it fast enough, Aerith. You know, it's sort of just similar. Whatever point is, hey, let's talk to these people. Huh? Who the hell are you? Who do you think you're talking to? I don't know, you won't tell me your name. Ah, what a drag. You want to go to that store in Sector 6 again? Okay, can I go past them? No, I cannot. Okay. Cool. Random break in the wall. Let's go up again to the most cheery place ever. That guy in the pipe's a weird one. No matter what you ask him, he only answers uh or ah. You ever hear of the of wall market? Nope. It's a market in the slums of Sector 6. They've got everything you could ever want there. If you can get there, that is. The road's something else. Okay. Is this the pipe you were talking- Oh, hey, Eris. What do you want? This guy is sick. He passed out nearby, and someone must have helped him here. Okay. This is the guy that only says, uh, or ah? Uh, ah, uh, uh. Yeah, because he's sick. He's sick, you jackass. This is the one. Won't you help him? Uh, listen, I'm no doctor. You, you, do, you do have cure magic, though. You both do. No, I guess not. Hey, that man has a tattoo. I think it's the number two. Okay. Is that significant somehow? It might be. I don't remember. It's probably a part of some kind of optional side quest or whatever. Hey, kid, don't run away. Out of the way, move. You want something? Move into the store. Okay, dog. Dogger, what do you want? Yeah, just bark. Okay, good. Bark like a dogger. What am I doing? I'm walking around looking at the ground. You find a lot of things people drop when you look down. You never find them when you're looking up, right? I guess not. I guess not. Okay. Alright, let's just start going into every single one of these buildings one by one. To see what they all are. Hey, you. Hey. Hey, didn't your mother ever teach you not to barge into houses and open up people's freezers? I was trying to actually get around to talk to you. But, uh... I don't care if it's scrap metal or materia. We can get anything here in the slums. Got a lot of good materia here. Why don't you look it over? Sure. Fire, ice, lightning, and restore. Great. Uh, pretty sure I already have restore on cloud. Why? Hmm. I guess it doesn't show up. I thought it was supposed to tell you when you already own stuff. Oh, to the right there. Yeah, equipped. Owned, owned. Okay. We don't have any fire. I don't want any fire right now, so... Anything else in this guy's place we can steal or look at or examine or anything? 
Nope, okay. Kind of funny that just examining the uh, counter anywhere triggers him. Hey, lady! What am I doing? Oh, oh you're the same person from before. You look different from the front. Alright, and in here. That's a. That's just a pipe! That's not even a counter! What kind of business you run in here, lady? Hmm, hmm. We only trade items for Gil here. Okay. I didn't think you were trading in toenail clippings or some shit. Okay, uh, more stuff I don't really need right now. I got some Phoenix Downs. Could be useful. We only have two. Let's take four. Sure, that's not too expensive, I guess. Alright. Oh, jeez. Come on, move. The... For some reason, inside buildings, the, uh... Directions are kind of weird, but whatever. Oh, yeah, I completely forgot to mention, yeah. Uh, I meant to, but I forgot. So now I'm mentioning it now. I hope you all enjoy the uh, little intro that I made, and expect an outro as well at the end of the video. So stick around and see that. Ooh. Hmm, everything President Shinra says is a lie. But you can't trust that avalanche, or whatever you call them. You can bat it around all you like, but it all comes down to wanting to live like the people up there. So who do I believe in? Myself. Me. I never lie to myself, that's for sure. And now for the news. A terrorist attack by the group called Avalanche has parts of Midgar temporarily out of power. They will be restored momentarily. Following President Shinra's address, Mayor Domino also spoke out today against Avalanche. Okay. Yep, sounds like you guys are really winning that war. You go, guys. You do the... You fight the good fight. Like you do. That's a cool bed, kid. Glug, glug. Now, no one will find it. Numb. Top drawer. And the bottom one. <laughs> okay. Sure. Hmm, huh? Open the top drawer. Open the bottom drawer, open the hidden drawer between them. Guess I'll just open all of them. Empty. Okay, open the bottom drawer. Empty. Open the hidden drawer between them. Huh? Five gill. Take it, leave it. It's only five gill. I'm not gonna steal the poor kid's last five gill. I've got over 3,300 gill. I don't need his five. Why does he say glug glug though? I mean, I don't know. Am I supposed to take it? Is that like a trigger for some kind of special event or something? I just don't know about it? Like, it's weird. Why would they even give you the option to steal five gil? That's like, that's nothing. It's five gil. Whatever, alright. I guess this is the shop that other kid's yelling about. What do you want, little girl? Why are you sitting up there? Get down, you're gonna hurt yourself. Toot toot, next stop Midgar, Midgar. Any passengers getting off at Midgar should please ring. You know, Midgar's supposed to be sparkly and springy and sleeky. Oh yeah, someday I'm going there. Sure, kid, you got hoop dreams. And those are guns. Those are guns on the table. Those are real, literal, real life guns. Cool. Guess, uh, guess censorship in the, in, in 97 wasn't as hard on as I remember it. Hmm. Oh, well, hey, taking care of yourself is the law of the slums. But to do that, first need weapons, right? You're yeah, totally right, man. Titan bangle. I just bought the other stupid bangles. Grenade. Explosive damage against one opponent. That, that's just a one-use item that just does a bit of damage. I don't want to waste that. Should I buy three of these? How much would they cost? 840? Uh, hmm. Sure, might as well. What else am I gonna spend my money on? I can, uh, sell the regular uh, Oh, I can sell the bronze bangles, first of all. Those are the ones we started the game with. Oh! Now I've got four of these? Damn it. Yeah, just sell one. I guess I picked up one somewhere and forgot. Oh well. Alright, 
Let's equip you. Instead of that crappy iron bangle, let's give you a titan bangle. That's four extra defense, two defense percent, and two magic defense. Awesome. On top of the regular one, of course. Restore all the blah. And let's equip you there with titan bangle. Oh, uh, eh, we can give her some materia, I guess. Let's give her lightning and ice just for the hell of it. Maybe she'll do some more damage if we use magic. I don't know. Oh, sell. Item Iron Bangle. And Bronze Bangle. Great. Awesome. Let's get out of here. Alright, uh, anything over here? Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay, and that's the hole where the sick guy lives. So let's head north. To nothing? Why can't I go up there? Okay. What? I. I thought. What's this here for? I thought this is another section of the city or something. Or another section of the slums, not the city. It's just a dead end? Why is it. It looks like a pathway. Am I going. I mean, I'm even, like, pressing the interact button to examine in, in case there's something I'm missing, but... Going along the entire edge of it, and there's just... Nothing. Okay, that's weird. That's super duper weird. What's this thing? Can we examine it? Nope. Okay. No path over there. No. Okay. Oh, what about over here? There you go. There's the... Exit and oh hey, it's over to Aerith's house. There's a safe point, I'll keep that in mind. And what's that pink thing? Is that a materia? Yo. Just, just somebody just left materia in your really extravagant garden. Holy crap, look at this thing. Received cover materia. What it does that do? What does it do? Protect allies when attacked. Sure. Actually, let's put all on that and then cover here. There you go. Cool. Cool. Great. Awesome. Fantastic. Anything behind the house? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Alright, now let's head in and I guess talk to her parents. I'm home, Mom. This is Cloud, my bodyguard. Bodyguard? You were followed again? Elmira, or Elmira. Either way, that's a cool name. Are you alright? You're not hurt, are you? I'm alright. I had Cloud with me. Thank you, Cloud. So what are you going to do now? Is Sector 7 far from here? I want to go to Tifa's bar. Is Tifa a girl? Yeah. A girl friend? Girlfriend? No way. Yeah, that's right. I don't know. I don't know. Let's uh, say. You know what? Uh. Eris! I don't see this uh, as, uh, you know, a relationship here working out all, all that well. But I don't exactly have a relationship with Tifa. I'm just, I'm just gonna leave my options open for now. Hee hee hee. You don't have to get that upset. Well, that's nice. Let's see, Sector 7? I'll show you the way. You gotta be kidding. Why do you want to put yourself in danger again? I'm used to it. Used to it? Well, I don't know. Getting help from a girl. A girl? What do you mean by that? You expect me to just sit by quietly after hearing you say something like that? Mom, I'm taking Cloud to Sector 7. I'll be back in a while. Don't forget to pick up milk on the way out, honey. Just walk a little slower. You couldn't have talked to her from the stairs. Nope. But dear, I give up. You never listen once you've made up your mind. That's parenting for you. But if you must go, why don't you go tomorrow? It's getting late now. Yeah, you're right, Mom. 
Eris, please go make the bed. Okie doke. <laughs> Just give up. Just give up and let your kids do whatever they want. That's, that's how you raise them right. That's how they'll grow to be nice, responsible adults and everything. And anything I can examine, steal in this house, I don't feel bad stealing from you. You're a member of my party, Eris. I will steal everything you own. That glow in your eyes. You're from Soldier, right? Yeah, where I used to be. I don't know how to say this, but... Could you please leave here tonight without telling Eris? Uh... Oh, let's see what Eris has to say about that. If I leave and, and don't tell... If, if I leave and don't tell you, will you mind? You need to go through six, Sector 6 to get to Sector 7. Sector 6 is a little dangerous, so you better get some rest tonight. Cloud. Good night. Oh yeah, was, uh, yeah, you totally needed to stop me just to say that. Mm-hmm. Oh, man. Oh, jeez. Seem pretty tired. I haven't slept in a bed like this for a long time. Oh, yeah. Ever since then. Oh, this is a completely different house. My, how you've grown. I'll bet the girls never leave you alone. Not really. I'm worried about you. There are a lot of temptations in the city. I'd feel a lot better if you just settled down with a nice girlfriend. I'm alright. I have to remember to do his voice. You should have an older girlfriend. One that'll take care of you. I think that would be best for you. I'm not interested. Yes, you should have the you should have a girlfriend who acts as a motherly figure, like one who maybe sells flowers and wears really long dresses and stuff, and uh, asks you about your other girlfriends. And, you know, just I don't know who. I must have fallen asleep. No suggestions, just saying. Sector seven's past sector six. I should be all right by myself. No, no, pick up the item. Don't you dare walk away without getting that potion and phoenix down. Oh, oh, oh. I tried to run, and it made noise. Cloud, I thought the Turks came back. Get some rest. So I actually have to sneak out? It's kind of funny. Hmm. Can't get caught this time. Okay. I wonder what happens if I try to go into her door. Thought the turn just same thing, okay. Okay, game, I get it. You're gonna give me infinite chances to do this and I have to sneak out and try to leave. No other choice. Yep, can't get caught this time. Just walk gingerly down the stairs and hope they don't have any creaky floorboards. Oh yeah, she, she'll totally never see that coming. Never ever. And let's... Come on, why can't... Let me save, game. Yeah, thank you. I just want to save real quick. In case I die, because there's probably a battle coming up, so just in case. Alright, now what way... Uh, I think the garden's a dead end, isn't it? Yeah, so we gotta go back the other way. Back to the slums! No, I didn't want to actually run into that again. So, I guess we just go down here. Oh, those two guys. Those two dudes who were uh, very suspicious looking. Oh, hey, whoa, you blocked me. You're up bright and early. I couldn't ask you to go. I knew it would be dangerous. I was just about to say, yeah, they were like standing in front of that hole and they were talking about Sector 6, so that that hole probably leads to Sector 6. Are you done? You have to go through the slum in Sector 6 to get to Tifa's 7th Heaven. How did you know it was called the 7th Heaven? I didn't tell you that. Are you a stalker? Huh? I'll take you there. Come on. 
Oh well, gee, I guess. Sure, okay. That's okay. Sure. Oh, this place. I remember this place. It has like a shit ton. An absolute just garbage pile of like monsters. And they're all like robots or something. Oh, jeez. Oh yeah, not robots. Creepy houses. That that works too. Thanks for the damage. It was great. Let's use some ice because I can. 88 damage. Yeah, it's pretty dang good. Suicide drop. Whoa there, guy. Careful. You might hurt yourself using a move like suicide drop. Yeah, sure, melee still does terrible damage, so I should probably just keep her doing magic. Oh boy! What? Uh, I wonder if Bolt does more than Ice. Ice did 88, this does 83, Ice seems a bit better. Fire would probably be good on this, it's, uh, you know, partially made of wood. Oh, actually, just attack and Cloud, use your limit. Loon attack. Hey, go. Yeah, slam down real hard. You did it. Woo. Kind of makes me wish I bought the fire thing now. Hmm. Oh, shit. Isn't there, like, an item on that hand? Uh. All right. Let me use this cure real quick. And then we'll run back and we'll check the hand. Because I think there's... Should there some, be something in here? No. There's nothing. It just looks cool. Damn it. Tricked again by things that look really cool. Man, I hate when that happens. Oh, lovely. This again. Okay, ice and attack. Eighty-nine. Awesome. Great damage. Good job. Alright. There you go. Take another one. Seems to be doing less damage this time. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm just not paying attention or something, but it seems like the house hasn't done as much. I don't know. Whatever. It should die this turn. Probably. Or not. Okay. Wow! A limit again? Seriously? Yeah, just use a cure. You finished off with ice. Oh, Eris got her limit break now. Her limit break is a heal, if I remember correctly. Which makes sense. Since she's supposed to be the, you know, flower girl, healer type person. Okay, uh, this is a dead end. Cannot interact with it? No? Okay, sure, fine, I'll take your word for it, game. Oh, and we can walk up that, too. Okay, and that is dead end. Cool, so let's go. God damn it. Oh, the random battles. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. All right, you just ice and you do the limit break. I'll save Eris' uh, limit break for when we've actually taken some damage. go, smack it around. It's doing suicide drop. I think it only transforms once it gets down, like, below half health, if I'm not mistaken. So, you know, that's good news. Though it's annoying that it took a limit break. Oh, okay. Yep, cool. Okay, it's dead. I was gonna say, it's annoying that it took a limit break and that seemed to combined with one of her ice things that only did half its health. I guess it has about 400 health, or 300, somewhere around there. Okay, 
And up here we go. The gate to Sector 7's in there. Thanks. I guess this is goodbye. You gonna be alright going home? Oh no! What will I ever do? Isn't that what you want me to say? Take her home, go on to Sector 7. Well, we just, we just came all this way. But I guess she did show us the way, so... Yeah, I, I guess the purpose was her showing us the way, not guiding us through, so I guess it's fine to take her home. Isn't that a little out of the way? Yeah, I guess so. Can we take a break? Sure. Well, you, you want me to push you on the swing or something? You want? Do you want to push me on the swing? I, 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 could, I could use a push, really, I think. I think I deserve one. Oh, snap. Can we get up here? Nope. God damn it, it's not letting us... What a, why can't you just let me interact with it and go crawl through the hole and come out the slide or something? Whatever, alright, let's talk. I can't believe it's still here. What are you doing on the top of it? How'd you get up there? The thing looks steep as hell. Cloud, over here. Okay, sure. I'll just get on top of the really tall thing as well. What rank were you? Rank? You know, in Soldier. Oh, I was... First class. Just the same as him. The same as who? My first boyfriend. Were you serious? No, but I liked him for a while. I probably knew him. What was his name? It doesn't really matter. Oh, it matters. Oh, oh, oh it matters. I played Crisis Core. It matters. Oh, who's this pompous fucker? With his chocobo drawn carriage and his fancy beard. Huh? Hey, back there. Tifa? What? Oh no! That girl in the cart was Tifa? Where was she going? She looked kind of odd. Oh, looks like heiress to the rescue. I'll go on alone. You go home. Ugh. Unbelievable. No way. Can we go in here? Is this a thing? Nope, it's not. Okay. Well, unfortunately, I'm out of time for this episode, so I'm going to have to end it here. But I hope you all have enjoyed it. When we come back, I guess we're going to go rescue Tifa and keep dancing around the subject of... Uh, Eris's last boyfriend who is super crucial to the plot of the game not even really a retcon just thing he should have he would have been a better character than Cloud probably to be honest but whatever that's okay I'll see y'all next time Buh bye bye